Welcome back. Let's get back to it. So I'm thinking we'll do the... Uh, let's see. Let's do... Emerald Grove Environment Roadside Cliffs. Where was it? Let's do Roadside Cliffs. I do wish you could see the uh, world map. And maybe there's a way I'm missing. That is interesting. Uh, I think we go down, grab the locked chest here. Then maybe come up here. I do want to do the quest there too as well as i am curious about i want to finish this uh this thing here so i'm i want the whatchamacallit let's not set ourselves on fire too no one is allowed to set themselves on fire most of all me Yeah, there's a locked chest here. I didn't open it because I wasn't sure how uh, how those all worked. And you. And I doubt it's for that because it would be, be crazy, but he also has that uh, toll collector's key. It'd be funny if that actually worked. Nope. Open lock. Does that work? Nope. All right. We will lock pick. A crooked touch. I uh, don't even know why I added guidance. I don't need it. As long as we don't roll a one. We're fine. 28. I'd say we did it. Use thieves tools. That always scares me. But yeah, we have the same amount. No, never mind. That's, what do we got in here? Gold and a leather helmet. Dexterity saving throws plus one. Um, who would want that? Possibly a Starian. You have something. Maybe we'll give it to her. Hey, good looking. She does dex checks on something. I forget. Um, danger sense. Oh. Trap spells and surfaces. Okay, maybe not. Uh, we'll do it anyway. But that. Does she only have one horn? I guess so. I, how did I not notice that? Uh, show helmet. I think we'll, she just looks so cool. I'll, I'll hide the helmet. But yeah, she can have the decks. Okay, whatever. To live in more whatever. Nothing amazing, but uh, hey, clearing stuff out's good. Uh, I do wish we had a quest for this. It seems kind of weird we don't. It does look Still important, hungry. but hey, it is what it is. Wait, is there? Let's go to the overgrown ruins, or is, is that down below? Oh yeah, that's down below level. Let's go to roadside cliffs again. Okay. But yeah, let's uh, let's check out the chapel and then go deal with the paladin wannabes. Well, not even wannabe paladins, posers. All right, let's do a save here. Uh, let's toggle group mode Keep your distance, darling. and sneak. They won't see me. Yeah, I want to see, I want to make sure we're coming at this from the right angle. There's two guys here. They've mentioned grave robbing before. Uh, so yeah, we're just going to do a little, tiny little bit of exploring. Oh. Too high, nonsense nonsense we can go up another way but yeah there's a guy here warren oh i don't think we've seen her before colena as you are excuses just being careful Not mom. uh level two say so yeah, they're level two high elf doesn't say what it is though Okay. Okay, so yeah, we've got two here, one here, one here. I don't even know if they're enemies. Probably, though. Um, but yeah, we can get climbed up there. Oh, I forgot to check. Oh, shoot. Yeah, as I thought, leaving the, uh, leaving the... Uh, party. It does indeed break concentration. What is twisting vines? Let's get going. Just uh, flavor, I guess. Whoops. 
Um, so yeah, sneaking is not doing us much good considering we're out in the open, but... Ooh. Hey, nice. It always makes me paranoid when I see those. I'm like, is there more? Is there more? Not over here, it looks like. Twisting vines. Ooh. Okay. They actually do. Um. Okay. Good to know. I doubt it'll come to it, but maybe we could, like knock someone into that yeah there's some environmental stuff here i'll dig that with a shovel is that more yeah twisting vines Let's stick to the shadows oh oh there's the door and like how far are we from oh pretty far but yeah it's the same coastline as the harpies but far away Hey. Okay. Okay, and that's good to know. When we do perception, there's like a bright light that comes out because we've missed a few perceptions where I didn't know what it was doing. Okay. Um, we could even sneak up here. That could be a good way to start. Again, I'm just setting up. I don't even know if they're uh, hostile, but better safe than sorry. I will walk up and uh, see if... Because we've had some fights where it's like... Uh, well, not even fights. Encounters where sometimes... Where, where you can talk even if they are hostile. Do -do 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 -do. All right. Better than nothing. Dagger root. And the skeletons. Yeah, we did that. Um, okay, there's a hatch here. Nothing else. Uh, lock pick. Ooh! 20. We have 9 through 12. I wish we could get advantage on it. So this is like a 50-50, almost. Do we want to spend thieves' tools on 50-50? What would we do to get better at it anyway? I will leave it for now. We'll mark it on the map and leave it. Oh, it's marked on the map already. Okay. Yeah, that's uh, that's quite the uh, quite the lock for a dilapidated little thingy, no less. Um, can we jump up to there? Is the question. Not enough space. So we're better off sneaking down here and jumping up if we get the chance. Um, and considering they work well together, I think I'm going to run her. Damn, she's huge too. Didn't realize. Uh, but yeah, we'll run her over there too in case we do end up fighting. I'm not even going to bother sneaking yet because they haven't shown they're over here. Uh, let's uh, Now let's sneak though so we can see visions. Uh, yeah, so we... Oh, shoot, he can see. Okay, never mind my idea. We can still hide here and jump up and take her out if we need to, though. Um, but yeah. yeah, there's no way we're making that jump and th that we couldn't land on. So yeah, I guess here is going to have to be good enough place to start. Astarian, where are you? Oh, yeah, and we... we we got to uh, get those dirt mounds later, too. Ooh, they can actually see here when when she's coming. Okay, that's unfortunate. Uh, oh, and there's twisting vines there. Yeah, dang. There's. We'd have to time this really well if we wanted to do that sneaky stuff I was talking about, because when she turns when she comes down this way we do she does see 
over here, I think. But not on the way up, so I could do that. I guess it doesn't really matter because she'd be down here anyway. Um, mm -hmm. Oh, there's a foundation block. Can we sh like shoot that or something? Is it targetable? Oh, hey, look, we can. That's... Is that going to drop on... Cracked stone. We can, like... Okay. Um... I wonder. Because, yeah, I did see it here, but not... Bef not. Uh, I only saw it once, but it does seem like they can see over the... Yeah, and I got to be careful of the vines there. Yeah. Oh, they. Oh, we can't get there though. Um, Damn it! I'm just gonna to go for it. Let's go ahead and save. And I think. Time to rest. Shouldn't oh. wish to live in more interesting times. I've got a long road ahead. Time to press ahead. Uh, we probably should have someone there. Whoops! I bumped the mic. Probably well, should have someone there though. Maybe, maybe instead of doubling up, let's send Carlac over there. Light as air. Phew. Phew. Hoping she's athletic. Whoa, she's got a twenty-five uh, foot jump. That's pretty cool. Okay. Uh, Still breathing. And you know what? Let's, let's split you up for a sec, because we might as well do the digging. So yeah, he can shoot that from there if we need to. We're digging. We're digging. A wooden chest. Ooh. Two scrolls and some gold. That's pretty nice. See, I believe we can learn. Maybe that's the wrong type. Scroll ray of enfeeblement. Cast spell. Maybe there's different types of scrolls. Some you can learn from. I don't know. We'll look at it later. But still, I'm happy to have found it. Hopefully there's something equally shiny in this one. Arrow of fire and some gold. So that's a no. Oh well, not gonna complain. That other one was pretty cool. Uh, you get get over here with me. Uh, which way do we want to go in? This way or this way? This way is fine. And it's closer to high ground in case we do need to fight. Alright. Which is looking pretty likely. This is a little sus. You both twice as tall as me, but I'm half the bloody backbone. But we don't know what that thing even is. And what about the crypt? I'm telling you, it's a shit. He's funny looking. And the crypt can wait. Mari and Barton have been trying to break in for days. Now we stop. <laughs> we we just ourselves competition already. That's don't our stand ship. on the cracked stone. We could do the warlock one always fun. So yeah, it looks like we've actually are expected not to fight here, which is kind of surprising. Like, of course I could attack, but again, I'm trying to I'm trying to play relatively nice. Um, we can do warlock. Ships full of poisonous vapor is probably dem demonic. I'd stay away. Sure. Poisonous? What? See? That thing could be carrying a plague for all we know. There's no roll on it. We're leaving. Come on, move it. Huh. 
All right. Well, we got some uh, that. You're more cunning than you look. I thought we had a fight on our hands. Well, we got her approval, but uh, that was kind of boring and anticlimactic. Whoops. I like you at the bottom there. That's fine. Uh, yeah, that was, uh, oh, are you still sneaking? You can stop sneaking. Yep. No one stopped me. But yeah, that was uh, a little, little anticlimactic. Time and the elements have left the plaque unreadable. Okay, so we can bust that. We'll go up here in case there's anything else. Dragon egg mushroom. Can we get over there? Not really. And I don't need to take the ladder. Alright, well... Oh, I guess we did, anyway. Nothing, huh? That was, uh... Yeah, and I, we didn't even have to do a check. We just told them there's vapors and they ran pig's head and lemon. Yeah. Kind of disappointing, but hey. Is what it is. We got some shadow heart approval. That's something. Dang. Looks like there's stuff there, but there's not based on camera positions. Mm, let's get a backpack and a burlap sack. Tor Ooh, another torch. That's nice. Ooh, two more thieves' tools. Oh, you ran through the vine. All right. And containers are always good, I have learned. We've got a door here. That's it. We've got a door here. Oh, there's a bedroll. There's bedrolls there. They were camping here? Uh, so yeah, we can bust that open. I'm not sure what that does. That's crazy. Um, oh yeah, and we got a quest to explore the ruins. Is that all? Find a way. Uh, we met some bandits near... Some ruins? They've been trying to break into a crypt with no success. Whatever they're after is probably still inside. Um, I wonder. Let's see what happens if we uh, check that. There's something underneath here. Okay, very well. Uh, foundation block. Can we jump down there? We can, we take three damage. I wonder if we'll meet up. I want to jump down there now. We'll do the, this first. It's probably all the same area. And that hatch, wait a sec. I'm gonna mark that hatch. It's weird that uh, it showed up, but then didn't. All right. Everything all right out there? Not what I was expecting. Yes, it's me. Let me in. Gim Gim Gimbal Brock triggered Bach triggered triggered some trap. He needs help now. Let's deceive. Oh, this is uh good stuff. Watch this roll one. Hey, no, we got it there. We got there. Oh, I was hoping it wasn't safe out there. Get inside and I'll rustle up some bandages. Cheese your way through. Asterion is inspired. One inspiration gained plus 25 XP. Uh, we have four now. Inspiration can be spent to reroll an ability check. Complete background goals to gain more. Uh, whoops, that's not it. Uh, what was it? Uh, there we go. Got there. Uh, inspiration. I mean, it, it said, talk your way past the bandits and enter the chapel. <laughs> Soldier. Oh, Outlander. Learning to survive. Surviving unusual hazards of the wild will enhance your prowess and understanding. All right. Oh, okay. No talking our way out of this one, I guess. 
Um, Fuck yes. <laughs> dude, I love Karlak. <laughs> uh, Fuck yes. All right, we all get to go first. Um, you already have your stuff, so we don't need to get kills with uh, with you because you already have your temporary health. Uh, we found a way into the abandoned ruins, I'd say. Uh, okay, so it's just this one guy, right? Yeah. All right. Uh, rage charge. One, recharge per long rest. Okay. We've got three of them, though, so that's all right. Uh, oh, yeah. Unf it's, it is unfortunate that uh, your allies have advantage on melee attack rolls only, uh, only when... Oh, we should organize her thing, too. I won't do that right now. I'll just do the uh, basics, which is melee and ranged. You got piercing shot. Oh, some spells. Wait, thaumaturge? Gain advantage on intimidation and performance checks. Okay, interesting. That goes away. That goes away. She's gonna go up there. Something like that. We'll do more later. What are your cantrips? Just that. And what are your bonus actions? Long rest, so we don't need it. All right. So we're just gonna be doing a normal attack of some. Yeah, it's short rest. So yeah, we'll just do a, a main. Jeez, look at her damage. Oh. Uh. Oh. Okay. Uh. But. Yeah. Oh, prepare. Oh, sh oh, it is short rest. Dang, I thought you could just do it. She's got some good stuff, though. And what is brace ranged? Spend your movement for the rest of your turn. Roll range damage twice and use the highest result. It's pretty nice. Uh, we will just main hand 4 through 15 here. Reactions once per round a character can react to another action manage your available reactions in the reactions tab Cool 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 reckless attack gain advantage on attack rolls until the end of your turn, but enemies also have advantage against you um, Yeah, I mean I think we're gonna kill him this turn uh, I want to see the combat log there Main hand weapon attack roll Where, where, does it show, show we rolled twice? I don't know, but whatever. We did a ton of damage and nothing else to do. So let's go ahead and end turn. This is good. Um, Shall we Asterion. Uh, let's go. Oh yeah, and is two weapon fighting on? Uh, Cause yeah, I, I looked up what this does. Cause like I said, I was curious. I wanted to dual wield and I couldn't figure out what was going on. Um, But yeah. When this is on, you do a f attack and a and use a bonus action. Let's see if I can show. Uh, yeah, you can see when I highlight him, it's using up, it's highlighting and using up uh, our main action and our bonus action. But you don't always need that, so it's better to do it manually, which I believe is the same as like so we can attack once here. Um, and then we can manually offhand if we need to. Uh, so yeah, I think it's better to leave that off. Uh, we'll just go in here. I want to see if sneak attack triggers. It should, because we have advantage because she's nearby. Main hand attack. It doesn't look like it, but whatever. Maybe we do have to manually trigger another short sword another torch nice now everyone can have torches leather armor bandits key bottle uh speaking of torches let's actually whip out our torch uh let's just whip this out here uh i thought we all had torches oh yeah now we do we don't need to equip them all but i will lead the way And move. Does that just turn it off? Yeah. This is cool. This feels classic RPG, the the dungeon. 
I'm going slowly because it feels like there should be traps around. Oh, I hear voices too. In that room. Uh, looter's trunk. Minor valuables. Cheese wedge. Sausage links. Dang, I thought there was more here. Cheese wheel. Uh, supply pack. That's pretty good. 40 supplies. Cheese wedge. Wooden crate. Normally the patron god is obvious. Burning. Right here. Ooh. How long does it last? Can we dip weapon in fire? Cool. Three turns, so that'll wear out pretty dang quick. Ooh. I'm not sure if there's anything there, but I'm glad I noticed it. And it doesn't look like there's any books or anything. There a oh yep yeah, another shelf. Carafe of water. It's weird that some of this doesn't get highlighted. Not sure if that's intentional or not. Did we? Yeah, we just did that one. I am digging the Carlac though. That's pretty dang cool. Enough space. Stack of books. Unclaimed. Stack of books. Stack of books. Death and divinity. Death and divinity. Mortal way. These are probably worthless. Why am I picking them up? Help me! Ancient, indecipherable text covers the plaque. A dead tongue. Whoever worshipped here must be long gone. Okay. What's the lever do? I don't know. Um. Let's read those books. Oh, cool. Oh. Oh, because we have that out. Okay. Um. We'll give those over later. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Leather armor is the same, but I think I've tried it before and didn't like it. Wait a sec. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, not as good as what we have looking, though. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Candle. That's it. interesting. We've got fire on us. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah, those are pretty worthless. I'll leave them since I already picked them up, though. But yeah, that's what I wanted to know. I'm just going to put the books down there to uh, remind me. Lid. Okay. wonder what the lever does. Careful, I'm bound. Pick the door. Whoops. Uh, lock pick. Let's crack it open. Fifteen. Um, nine. We've got a decent chance, but I, I will try the lever first. Yep. Ooh, they're fast. They're fast. That's not great. And they're hostile. Despite being named, I wonder if there is a better way to resolve this. Don't care. Um, all right. Piercing strike. Piercing shot. Oh yeah, and that was another setting I changed. As you can see, I don't have to hover or inspect. Are we on latest already? There we go. Uh, we'll leave that open. Uh, but yeah, it now shows full tool tips, which is pretty nice. Uh, Gaping wounds, which, which is attacks against this creature deal more damage. I don't think we need it. Because, yeah, if we can get out of here without taking too much damage. Oh, shoot, there's a wizard. Thankfully, they move last, so we need to not be grouped up when the time comes. Um, 
but yeah, we will do, oh yeah, I didn't need to manually switch. We can ranged attack, right? Yeah, I think so. Uh, oh, wow, we could actually piercing shot. Oh, and do they count as surprised? Can we sneak attack them or whatever? So yeah, let's actually see if we can sneak attack ranged. Uh, must have advantage against target. That's unfortunate. I, oh, uh, do, 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 V? Whoops. No, not V. Uh, shift. It looks like they can't see us, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to use one of our bonus actions to hide. And then we're going to sneak attack, because that's our highest damage chance. 91, 88. Let's try to take out the guy with less health. Shit, they spotted us as I came in, so I can't sneak attack anymore, right? Yeah. Son of a... It's unfortunate. Maybe I should have tried, like, tried to position here. Ah, oh, man. Alright, range attack. 70. We'll still go for the guy with less health. Six damage. Uh, question is... We have a bonus action. We can offhand attack. We can get up there. Uh question is do we want to because do we want our rogue getting swarmed you're gonna take let's see mari and barton will go uh, i'm a little worried but i if we run back i'm taking the hits it looks like i i think we just try to get our try to get our damage in here we could even flourish but offhand is fine I think I'll do it. It's a little greedy, but let's go ahead and offhand. Okay, not bad, not bad. Uh, but yeah, now we're kind of screwed. Flea combat. And, ooh. Sneak attack. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Uh, he took a ton of damage. Probably means we're going to short rest after this so we can go a little nuttier on our abilities. Oh, shoot. Okay, I want to kill you. Uh, kill you and get in the way. So, um, what are your bonus actions like? Jump. Legacy of Avernus. Oh, that's on your weapon. So we, uh, we could start raging. Um, it's no good. Um, we could jump 25 feet. Is that the range? Oh, it does look. Oh, we, so yeah, we do have to move. Oh, that uses up all of our, our actions, but we can still get there. Um, so yeah, I think if we have to get there, we have to we have to do that jump. Um, kind of too bad. Um, reckless attack. That's not great. Um, Yeah, we'd be taking a little too much damage there, I think. Um, well, that was some weird audio stuff. I think... Dang, that's unfortunate. Um, yeah, right. We definitely want a main hand. Unfortunately, we can't... Oh! Yeah, so yeah, to get close enough, we do have to jump, so that's what we're going to do. And I'll kind of try to block. We better deal with the wizard Go too, because we're going to be in trouble here. Uh, then let's do main hand attack. 70%. Hey, there we go. We can even loot same turn. Dagger, short bow, leather armor. Okay. Um, and yeah, we can't do anything else that used up all our actions. So yeah, we're grouped here. So wizard's gonna be a problem. 
Um, and yeah, Sh Shadow Heart's gonna have to heal. Ooh, what was that? Concussive Smash? Possibly dazes your target. They can't take actions and lose the dexterity bonus to their armor class. Uh, hit for seven. Roll to five, unfortunate. Um, you only have 15. Can we smack you around that? Ooh, this might be a time for Scorching Ray. Just obliterate the wizard. I think that's a good play. Let's make sure we have line of sight, which we'd have to move, but thankfully we have enough to do that. Yeah, I think we can just move up and attack. Oh, and nice, we can move 40 feet because of uh, Gale's thing. Um, yeah, let's start by just moving here. Have to keep going. And let's just make sure 80% chance to hit. Oh, and we can do each one individually, it looks like. I think that's, is that, yeah, 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 nice. Um, 66, roll three rays. That's pretty nice. All right, uh, let's do this. Um, ooh, and it level doesn't grant any additional. Uh, let's hit you with, there we go, strength. So that's 1d6. This is four through 13, not, four. yeah, just not worth it. Um, question is two through 12, four through 24, plus the one D six. That's a pretty decent, I think we hit two. Should we hit all three just to make sure we hit? Cause one could miss at 80%. So yeah, this is overkill. I think I just want her not to have a turn though. Actually, no, because I'm going to want to heal with her just to be safe, I think. So yeah, let's just hit everything. Oh! <laughs> uh, okay, we, so yeah, we did Scorching Ray on Kefri. Missed. Hit for eight. Hit for two necrotic. Holy shit, that stacks. Okay, so when you multi-hit, you multi uh you multi-hex as well. That's sweet. We're out of spell slots though, but um, aside from that one. Uh wow, and yeah. So yeah, I'm glad we did hit with all rays, because we did miss with one. No, we would have oh yeah. Yeah, that last one wouldn't have hit. We would have just done 10 damage if we'd targeted two. So that was the correct uh, correct thing. And let's go to this. Uh, put the... Oh, shoot. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Don't start combat with a torch in your hand. I can't re-equip my shield this turn because it costs an action. I wonder if I, if I just clicked that, would it auto-selected? I don't know. Probably. Yes. Yes. Oh well. All right. So put to torch away. Don't shift. We swift. Switch weapons. Lesson learned. Okay. Let's end turn. The other. We don't have any other actions left. Oh, we do. We can move. Uh. I'll move over here. I'll move closer. Oh, we we got rid of the one I was most worried about though. Um. We're gonna want to let's see level two. Four, oh, that's what does upcasting do on that? Doesn't look like anything. Um, but yeah, I want to cure light wounds, which means we need to be in range. Uh, and your jump is 18 feet for 10 feet. So yeah, we would like to make a jump here. Let's just jump right over here and hope they don't have grenades or anything. Uh, do, 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 do. uh let's go ahead and heal cure wounds okay okay cool that that's what i was talking about upcast heals an additional one through eight hit points so this is four through eleven uh let's actually do it let's upcast what would we want what would we want 
to cast here. We'd miss out on spiritual weapon or prayer of healing, uh, which is only outside of combat. Um, yeah, I think we'll upcast the uh, the thing here just to make sure he doesn't die. Thirteen, yeah, almost full heal, nice. And you don't have any more actions. A starian. Uh, who's going next? Either either of these guys is going next. So I don't think we can kill you anyway, but might as well try. Uh, unfortunately, we can't get our sneak off because you're very visible right now, and I don't think you can hide while spotted. I guess, ooh, we could run hide. Ooh. What if we get in melee, can we hide in melee range? Let's see. Let's run over here. Oh shit, leaving an enemy's melee range allows them to attack you as a reaction. Avoid this by taking the disengage action first. That's unfortunate, we hit for seven, man. Brutal. Uh, oh, oh, he turned too. There goes that plan. Okay. Um, four through nine, four through eleven, uh, one through ten. That's disappointing. So uh, let's do a ranged attack on this guy. We'll just do the closer guy. Ooh, the critical hit, and then the offhand. <laughs> Oh, for one. Uh, offhand again, because we've got bonus actions. I think that's the best chance of our... We want to kill. That's going to be the best chance of our bonus action. Shoot. Is that... That's an oil barrel. Oh, oil barrel. Not... I, which I think make oil. Not... Not explosions. But maybe if we'd had some fire or something. But yeah, I think our best bet is to do another offhand attack. Hopefully we roll. Oh, we critically missed. Uh, and I, can you only be hit by one in a turn or something? It's letting me run away. Uh, I will. I will stay where we are though, because that gives this guy uh, disadvantage as well. He has to move if he wants to range attack. In fact, can I go up here? Yes. I'm blocking both. Hopefully, Astarian doesn't get downed. He is. Oh, I can't opportunity attack both. I'll actually let her go. Because, yeah, we only have one reaction, I believe. Um, so I'll actually let her go in case the other guy wants to run. Oh, cool. Athletics failed. Burton failed in athletics. Oh, he tried to shove. Um, What happened? Oh, we... Reapply Hex is concentration. So we lost our spell slot. That's unfortunate. Uh, rolled a critical fail on concentration saving. Uh, okay. Murray used range tech. I was hit for five. Failed saving throw against ranged attack. Must use like a poison arrow or something. Uh, dang, I wish we could have taken him out. Um, Saving throw against basic poison. Uh, I receive poison. Critical fail on concentration saving throw. Uh, yeah, rolled a one. Uh, broke concentration on hex. Lost, con uh, lost condition. Reapply hex. Through alchemist fire. Alchemist fire hit, uh, was hit for eight bludgeoning damage. That's the item itself. Shadow heart and Karlak received burning. Shadow heart took three damage. Karlak one. Burton failed to shove. Karlak took another one because she is burning. One to four damage per turn. Um, who's going next? This dude. Unfortunately, we can't do much about it. But I also... Oh, oh, he's used his, uh, his reaction, I guess. I wish there was a way to check. But yeah, it looks like we can move away without any... Thing if we did want to like take out this guy, but honestly, uh, sh you do so much damage, you're not who I want to do. We could jump over and try to do 
uh, take you out. Yeah, we could do something like that. That might be good. Wish we could do something about the fire. But yeah, let's uh, let's try this. Maybe I should have stayed and threatened him, but uh, let's go do, ahead and do main hand. Shoot, not enough. Maybe I should have done the big old, big old thing. I probably should have, because we'll, we'll have someone else take her out, like me. Uh, you'll stay there and threaten. Uh, you don't have any other actions. That costs an action. All right, we'll send turn. This is getting a little hairy, actually. He raged. Okay. Um, who's going next? Oh, um, we need to take out Mari and Barton. So yeah, we no longer have any spell slots. Oh, since we have a torch, at least we can do offhand attacks as bonus, uh, bonus action, uh, which is actually a pretty good bet on this guy who's so low. 20% disadvantage because we're not um, proficient, I'm thinking. E no, we are proficient. It's just our. Str I don't know why we're disadvantage. Oh, is it because we're poisoned? Uh, poison suffers disadvantage on attack rolls and ability checks. Yeah. Shoot. Uh, we could. We, I think we might even have an antidote in here, but it's a little ex like bottle it's not even usable yeah we do have an antidote is it worth it uh, it's a bonus action might be better off than trying some of these freaky stuff twenty percent yeah that's not worth and that's uh, 36 so yeah maybe we should Use a oh here here's the thing let's see what we want to do with Shadowheart first um where is a Starian anyway right there um so Starian can bonus hit that guy and then go over and kill that guy I think so reckless attack why wait why why do you have reckless attack and do you have reckless attack Yeah, wait. Oh, he used reckless attack. We could heal a Starion again. We could smack you around. But yeah, because I'm hoping a Starion can actually kill both these guys if I don't. So yeah. Uh, I think I think I will try. It's only 20%, but let's go ahead and hit this guy. Miss. Um, and then... Oh, I... 36. Hey, cool. We actually we actually got it. Nice. And I might as well loot here. Got more leather armor. Another torch. Okay. We can actually... Oh. Do we want to just uh, circle this guy? There's no point, really. I'll come back to him. So yeah, that's good. Um, we could heal Carlac. I think Carlac will be fine, though. 15. Yeah, you have less. Um, but yeah, I also want to, if possible, save my spell slots, because we will do a short rest after this, I think. Um, again, I'm not sure even the point of saving the... Uh, long rest. But yeah, a Starion should be able to take her out. Uh, two through nine. Uh, actually, oh, 
you would suffer from him. Yeah, let's just, I think it's simplest to get some damage on here. Actually, we could, we could fireball. Let's see. Bonus action, but use a spell slot. Okay. Um, blinds creatures. Uh, but yeah, what's your 50% versus 55? So yeah, we could just do that, try to kill her. Because yeah, then Astarian can just focus on this guy hard. Um, tempting, tempting. I think I will. Hey, perfect. And empty, empty. There's another torch there. Um, concentration. Oh, wait a s Oh, it's concentration, though. Um, I was like, what? It lasts so. It lasts until long rest? I wonder if short rest breaks concentration, because we could just cast this now. That's interesting. I should probably just be potentially casting that all the time on someone like Carlac, who's going to be up in the middle of it. Uh, but I'll wait until after long rest. Just So yeah, I don't think there's any reason to, to uh, be too close. I'll just uh, move up in case we need to heal. Let's go ahead and turn, Still and we'll, we'll get closer here. Actually, shoot, I guess I should always get in range. Oh, and I could have, no, I couldn't have. Um, okay, here's what we're going to do. He's, we're going to sneak attack melee. Wait, this actually does more damage. 88. 88, it's the same. So yeah, let's actually lead with a ranged attack. That was a underwhelming sneak attack. Then let's, we still have advantage. You wanna actually do some damage here, buddy? Guess not. And turn. Now this is my happy place. Okay, this is long rest. Oh, prepare and short rest. So yeah, we could do that. I wish you could sh sort by whether it's a short rest or long rest. This is long rest. Um, oh, we, we already have it. Was that reckless attack? Reckless attack? Yeah, that's pretty funny. 4 through 15 through 4 through 15. Oh, uh, short rest. Okay, so we could do bleeding, uh, but yeah, that just uses movement speed, and we're not going to do that anyway. Um, so yeah, let's actually prepare. Uh, we deal an additional three damage. Okay, and we can't do it twice. Uh, oh, because we don't have 40 movement. I wonder, I wonder if you can stack... Uh, Oh, no, because you can only use it once. Short rest, duh. All right, and on. I wish it showed damage on hover, but yeah, so we're at 4 through 15, but plus 3, I think. Um, that's a long rest. But do we want to let this guy get his turn off? It might be, be worth... That, or, that's also our only thing that uses a bonus action, really. Um, under raids. Uh, so, so yeah, question is, do we do 6 through 27 or 4 through 15? Uh, 6 through 27. So yeah, this adds fire damage and takes extra damage. I think we'll go ahead and use this just to make sure. Because, yeah, even if we don't quite kill, he'll take fire damage, too. I think we'll have to try it. 
Oh, wow. He lived with nine health. Did we super... Uh, receive conditioning, Seer and Smite. So he will take some damage. Uh, yeah, we rolled a five. Oh, he's got resistance or something too, but yeah, we rolled five out of 12, the lower side. He took uh, full fire damage and rolled one out of, oh no, damage roll is three out of three. So that's the uh, modifier. Is anyone in danger of dying? Potentially, this guy's a barbarian too, I think based on his move set. Um, nothing I can do about it though. Good, not quite dead. Almost, though. Uh, shoot. And you are still poisoned. and oh, Poisoned until long rest. Okay. Maybe we'll be doing a long rest instead of a short rest here, then. Uh, good to know. We'll take our first long rest here, I guess. Because, uh, yeah, poison just sticks around. Uh, that's no good. Bonus action. Wait, why is bonus action? Oh, that's that's the double attack I was talking about. Um, Shadow Heart, you're probably less likely to be a disaster here. 55, 55. Um, two through nine. Two th oh, they're the same. We'll be resting anyway, so we might as well do a uh, bigger attack. Two through nine, gaping wounds. That could be good. Two Target loses an action. We've got enough that we don't need to, though. Lose the dexterity bonus. That's decent. Let's go ahead and hit you with that. We did daze. Uh, you got nothing. What, what would shove do? Probably nothing. Um, Where do I go from here? Ah. Uh, is it worth curing? We have we have Asterion and Karlak next anyway. Um, so yeah, let's just do miss. Oh, you were two weapon fighting there. Unfortunate. Uh, let's put the door. Not enough resources. All right, this is a freaking disaster. Yep, nothing. Ooh, four health, man. You're gonna finish this off, right? 30 disadvantage because you're too close. Sneak attack. There we go. And are you still burning? No. All right. Wait, 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 wait. Who? Damn, it's good to be alive. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure what that was. Sh oh, Shadowheart was still burning. Jeez, that was quite the uh, thing. Uh, let's go ahead and save here. I'm scared of there being, like, fire somewhere I don't see. All right, empty, empty. We'll grab the torch. We'll grab the wooden barrel. We'll check these guys. Great club, javelin, leather boots, leather gloves. Uh, gold, thieves tools, dagger, short bow, leather armor. Thieves tools. Sefri, who we burned. Okay, another scroll. That's good. Quarter staff. Journey through the jungle. Uh, journey. I'm just putting my books down there to remind me. Stop. Okay. And I'm going to put stuff I want to try. Uh, quarter staff, and I'll s stick the scrolls down there too. I'll stick those down with the books actually. Scroll with burning hands. I don't know how you learn them. Um, do 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 do. Ah, great club. Car oh. Carlac, 
That's probably a U weapon if anyone's going to do it. Uh, 4 through 11. 4 through 11. All right, that's fine. All right, um, question is... I think we go back to... Uh, does long rest automatically go back to camp? Go to camp, long rest. Go to camp and end the day, yeah. Does it cost 80 to long rest? Okay. Uh, should we just short rest? It'll get most of our stuff, but she it only heals half health. And, oh, do you have... No, you don't have healing. That was the other... The other one had some self-heal. Um, but yeah, we could short rest and heal. I guess we could keep going. We'll, we'll have to long rest soon, but for now, yeah, let's short rest and... Oh, we don't have a level 2 spell slot. Uh, we can just heal. Alright, so yeah, for now we will short rest, then we'll long rest eventually. Uh, let's go ahead, short rest. Time to get going. Wizards, clerics, paladins, and druids can change their prepared spells at any time outside of combat. Wizards, clerics, so the, of our people, that's a cleric. Uh, and I don't, th I think I'm happy with what we currently have. Cantrips. Oh, I think these are our known ones, and these are our learned spells. I don't know. I don't know. Trickier, trickery domain. Um, do, 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 do. All's well that ends. Not as bad as it could have. Uh. I wonder what the next move is. So yeah, I think we're fine. I'm a, I'm almost disappointed. Like I'm like I, I thought we were gonna long rest, but we're not. Uh, yet we probably will ha have to after this though. Ancient scroll. Is that gonna? Yeah, give us more light. Book of Final Breath. A dense rows of scrawled text. The few legible entries seem to detail the names and final words of numerous individuals. Come see this. It's move. <laughs> Madge Pinner Laboratory Explosion. Hmm? Hroth Cress waylaid in a Neverwinter Alley. You're blocking my light, Donna Ree. Wa water, ta water Taven Featherlung. That's kind of funny. Uh, let's go ahead, take it. Whoops. What do you need now? Oh, you're splattered with blood. Ash and blood. Okay, I want to read these books, too, in case they're quest-related. So, we read that one. Book of Final Breath, Ancient Scroll. Uh, Though a bloom of mold has leached the ink uh, from most of the scroll, its beginning is still legible. The sealing ritual. Our god cares not for petty ritual. There is only the sealing, and it is vital that we observe it with exacting reverence. Wouldn't their necks get tired observing the ceiling? Uh, on the day of the ceiling, a mixture of bone and ash is uh, consecrated. Upon the names of the dead, we spread the offering, imbuing the ink with the essence of death of our god. Uh, okay. And I guess we can throw these back. No one needed them. We'll mess with that later. Uh, journey through the jungle. The sun had just fallen below the horizon when I first heard, sorry, I was just checking stream stuff. When I first heard its call, a thousand reed pipes at once whistling a single beautiful, terrible song. Good. Uh, Ulu Thalong said, Jaw, it's coming. Jaw dropped her pack. Huh. Okay. Jaw. I was thinking that male, but Jaw dropped her pack and scurried up the nearest bitter. With a little bit more effort, I climbed a tree of my own, and two of us surveyed the grassy ground beneath. A woo! There it was again, above and beneath and all around. So close, my skull vibrated from the sound. The ferns and foliage 
under me rippled and swayed jaw held a finger to her lips to demand my silence and in one motion it snatched her a vine a tentacle it hardly mattered the hunter had found its prey jaw's screams swelled then faded as uluth long dragged her away I leapt down to give chase, but the creature left no mark behind. The grasses were untrampled, the shrubs unbroken. I had only the memory of that harrowing call to guide me. Okay, that was Journey Through the Jungle. Let's do the Unclaimed. Uh, in life, her service had been impeccable. Daily did she devote herself to the Lady of Loss. Daily did she free herself from the tyranny of memory. All in time was lost to her, her relations, her preferences, even her own name. Upon the altar of her devotion placed the ultimate offering, her emptied mind. Uh, and when she died, when she awoke in death and found herself standing in the pale and faded city of judgment, she waited for the Lady of Loss to retrieve her. A million souls and more passed her in colorless gusts, but no hand materialized in her hand, no voice whispered instruction in her ear, no guidance proffered itself from the bleached and barren sky. Time, immaterial time, passed around her like air coming and going, and still the goddess did not come for her de devotee. Kelimvor pitied her as much as the Lord of the Dead is able, but could not intervene. This cleric of the Lady of Loss, unclaimed despite her worthiness, might yet have one more lesson to learn, that not of forgetting, but being forgotten. Uh, unclaimed, death and divinity, a godly guide. Death is too powerful a force for even a single god to contain. It is a duty that has been passed down from hand to hand splintered into smaller pieces disease war funeral rites but there must always be an overseer of this the cycle as life falls away for countless aeons it was Zhurgle, the lord of the end of everything presided over mortality with his unblinking stare until even he grew weary young Bo Bale, Bane, and Merkel, Baal, Baal, uh, must have thought themselves conquerors when they came for the god of death, yet he used their ambitions to free himself. Merkel claimed primacy over death from Jurgle's bargain, uh, but even he does not rule death alone. What is murder if not the most violent of deaths, seized by Baal in his incessant greed? What need would there be for noble Kelimvor to judge passing souls if one deity could hold the uh, process entire? Uh, even gods can die after all. Those who worship death should remember that above all else. They're worth some good stuff, too. The the Mortal View Eyewitness Accounts of the Balespawn Chronicle Crisis. Uh, the Guild Seal of the cover belongs to a uh, printmaking collective in Baldur's Gate. Of course I remember. Knew the second that girl was walking that she'd be trouble. Little thief, always in everyone's business. And that ward of Gurion went right along with her. No surprise, a wicked god's blood was running in their veins. Anonymous, Candlekeep. Saravak and his lot are always the first ones that come to mind. You know this all started with a bit of iron in Nashkill. Everyone thought their weapons would rot out of their hands. Back then, I thought the problem was bad trade. Never took the man for a son of Baal. Amnion mercenary interviewed on his deathbed. You dare speak that name to me? My mistress was turned to ash fighting those forsaken wretches. I curse Baal, I curse Irenicus, and I curse you. Hostile vampire, Athkak... Uh, Athcatleth slums. The five tore Tether to pieces. I don't think anyone expected more bail spawn showing up would fix the war that a pack of them started. Then again, they were all inclined to, ki to killing each other, eh? Good riddance. Here's hoping every last one of them has been wiped off the face of Faerun. Saradish merchant retired. I'm not authorized to be talking about any murder with someone like you. Take it up at the sea tower if you want to argue but honestly who cares if a bail spawn got it stuck to them their father is the killing type after all flaming fist gauntlet baldur's gate several hundred more interviews follow uh most of them terse cool 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 all right we did it let's keep moving
And I'm going to go a little slow in case there is anything bad here. Nothing in the chest. That's disappointing. Stack of books. Nothing. Stack of books. Curse of the Vampire. We'll move that down to unread. Books. Mortal View. That's the, yeah, that's the one we already had. Nothing. Nothing. Pile of books. Nothing. Shabby wardrobe. Clothes. We'll move those down to the tryout category. Uh, is that it? I don't need a bowl. I guess that's it. That was a fun, if a little, worrying fight. And just in case there is a fight, I should... Oh yeah, I can just click here. It makes it kind of dark, but... And yeah, we checked all these people. Uh, it makes it kind of dark, but it does mean we have the additional AC if we need it. Whoop. How does it open? Uh, do, 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 do. Explore the ruins. We found a locked door, but it doesn't have a keyhole. There's got to be something interesting behind it. We found a way into the abandoned ruins. I wonder. I can't see in comparison, but that might be where it comes down. But uh, I'm guessing you won't be able to lockpick it since there's nothing there. Lockpicking impossible. Yep. Have a lot of my mind. How how much experience did we get anyway? Uh, like 50, 60. Yikes. Nope. I'm thinking this is the hole, so I don't know where that is. Uh, let me mark that uh, in case. Whoops. Door, no handle. Yeah, I'm thinking we'll find a way in there, but just in case, I will mark it as I go. The Unclaimed, that's one of those books. Okay, there doesn't seem to be anything here. I'll whip the torch back out. Uh, Mortal View. Back of books. Curse of the Vampire and the Unclaimed. Uh, whoops. I have the wrong person selected. But yeah, we have read those let's get going can't slow down row of books the unclaimed unclaimed again this is fairly decent money unclaimed up oh, encumbered all right Stack of books. Nothing on any of those, huh? Wow. Mortal view, divinity. That was, yeah, divinity and death. Nothing. And we did that. Yep. All right. Do we have a backpack? We do. This is the throw everything in there. That's just simple robe. And the junk goes in too. That's fine. Uh, we'll throw that on over to you. Even things out. And the reason I'm not getting rid of the books is so I can tell, whoops, which ones I've read. Oh. Uh, the unclaimed. Wait, those are ones I want to read, I think. Um, mortal view. Yep. Okay. Runic chest. Rustic chest. Five candles. 
stack of books, stack of books, unclaimed. Yep. Whoops. How, how do you, there's, I know there's a way, but it's late. I'm tired. Uh, mortal view, nothing, nothing. Whoops. Again, what do you want? Unclaimed Curse of the Vampire. Oh, there we go. Uh, oh shoot. It got all messed up though. We did that. What was that? Death and Divinity? Death and divinity. Dude, if these actually sell for stuff, we're gonna be pretty rich here. Oh, almost missed you. Unclaimed. Is there one under there too? Nope. Mm, let's do the plaque. You do not recognize the language on the plaque. Looter's trunk. Uh, let's walk carefully. Oh. Hey. Nice. We did that one. Yeah. Oh, and I'm going to light all these. And the reason I'm going to do that is because I suspect this up here is... Oh, actually, we can kind of see, right? No, because that's not... Um, but anyway, I want this well lit so I can verify if this is the correct place or not. Uh, uh, because I think this is the hole that uh, we broke. Chapel records. Find dust coats the pages of this weathered book. Beneath the bone white powder, hundreds of short obituaries are recorded in tiny script. Grobian Tip Tipler, Ilmater, Drowning, er Evain, Arkinson, Ogma, Infer Internal Rot, Devrin, Stout, Saloon, Fever. Pick it up. Grab everything. All right. Let's get this all sorted. That we read. Journey Through the Jungle we read. The Unclaimed. That's the, uh, that's the one that, yeah, in life... Uh, death and divinity. That's the one about, with the, uh, and that's the other one about the bale spawn. Uh, that, that will use as a marker. Curse of vampire and final breath. I don't think we've read. Um, oh no, that one we have. You're blocking my light. What are you going to do? Stab me? Come see this. It's moving. Uh, curse of the vampire. Uh, hearken close and beware the vampire. Uh, beware its cold beauty, beware its charm, beware its curse. Above all, beware the pale noble, for the vampire uh, cannot bear to be of the common folk. How doth one protect from the beast? Walk not in blackest night for the vampire. I'm just going to say vampire. Uh, loves these nights more than any other. If you, w if you must walk, do so by the light of our moon and take care. Carry the blessings and marks of your god at all times. But remember, your home is a fortress if protected well. If you hear a knock in the night, be wary. Let no stranger into your home. If it, if it be a friend, look upon them. Do you find them pallid and wan? Uh, see you any mark upon their neck? See you any dirt upon their clothes? Unless their need is great, turn away all but the most trusted. And if the beast finds a way into your home, flee. Leave love and family behind. You will not save them if you fight. You will not see them again. But they will see you, pale and smiling, calling them into the night. Damn! Uh, and I haven't mentioned it, but Asterion's clearly a vampire. When we first talk to him, you see... Well, he's got fangs, and you see bite marks on his neck. Um, yeah, so there's that. There's that. Speaking of vampires. Let's pull that. I'm thinking that's... I wonder what that did. I know what that did. Hell yeah. Called it. Called it so hard. Oop, I don't want to sit down. I do want to see if there's anything up there, though. Doesn't look like it. 
Okay, let's get out of here. And we'll light, light up some more candles too. Yeah, that was a gnarly fight. Iron Candle Island received condition burning. It's a fern. Candles, light it up. No particular reason. Uh, and I'm thinking not, but yeah, invalid target, not enough space. Can we climb up here? No. Can we jump up here? Target is too close. I just want to get a better... Nope. Wanted to get a better view, but no such luck. Let's go ahead and save again. Let's go ahead and open a door. Oh, hoo. Dank crypt. Dank. Um... Explore the ruins. Let's see what we got going on there. Uh, we found a locked door, but it doesn't have a keyhole. There's got to be something interesting behind it. The strange door led deeper into the ruins. There are bound to be some interesting artifacts down here. I hope so. I hope so. Ah, that's this oh. place wasn't built for the living. Ooh, okay, more scrolls. Again, I'm not sure exactly how to use them, but I like scrolls. Okay, we just took that one. That's fine. And I think what I'm going to do is put the torch away on me and put it on someone who it doesn't equip something so if I put it on so yeah you have 16 AC if I pull a torch out with you okay so it costs that for you and it replaces your offhand weapon and I'm not even sure if you're proficient in it uh, but it might be best on her she does uh, 4 through 15 oh so it does replace it okay that's annoying. Uh, then I guess we will put it on him because he's got a offhand weapon anyway. So yeah, he doesn't... He is proficient, but he it's a strength weapon. So he adds strength, which is negative. And so yeah, but at least... Eh, except he's actually more likely to use it. I guess we will just do it on, on me and take the... Uh, AC penalty if we get into combat. Moving in. Wow, bunch of stuff. Uh, I'm just lighting everything up so I can see. Let's grab this torch. A gilded chest. Hopefully this will be better than the uh, last ones. Oh, I see. Oh my god! I want loot, not junk. Oh, almost missed you. Let's, uh, let's read you and then pick you up. An excerpt from the ongoing Metatext Rebound by uh, Metatext Rebound by Esefa Elgin, a scholar excommunicated from. Have we read this one? Uh, no, no. It's just a. It's we've read part of it. Of what value is a life? Hmm. Is this about soul coins again? No, nope. I thought we had read it there for a second. Of what value is a life? Far too esoteric a topic to warrant any serious uh, critical consideration between these pages, surely? Or so it would seem at first glance. Uh, but once we push aside the mysticism and dewy-eyed sentiment so, so often clouding our assessment, it is clear that across all the spinning planes, each and every life does indeed have a quantifiable value. It is simple, simply that not all are equally valuable. Consider, we already know that the destruction of our material form is not the end. If anything, our souls are more free after death, transcending planar 
ba ba barriers. I'm tired and loopy. Uh, in search of a resting place that best befits our deeds, beliefs, and station in life. But even this assessment is subject to market forces. Lord Kelimvor, weighing our souls against how thoroughly we have given them over to other gods, empowering them in turn. There is, of course, an alternative, alternate route, not the end of the path, but the chance to retread it. Clerics across the realms wield the, wield the power to return life to any soul deemed worthy or willing enough. It is strange, then, that these so frequently intersect with those deemed wealthy enough, for the components for such a spell are beyond the means of me most mortals. I have interviewed those who have made such a return, and in truth they have found them to be of the most dull and unimaginative sort that I cannot possibly imagine what it is they were so eager to return to. It is a true assessment of the journey to... If a true assessment of the journey is to be made, then there is simply no replacement for embarking upon it oneself. Perhaps one day, this great volume of learning will make me worthy enough to walk that path and wealthy enough to return. Uh, where'd that book end up? Is that it? I don't know. I don't care. Oh, we haven't picked it up yet, of course. No. Uh, oh. I, f I was doing it by reflex, but I forget how now. There's heavy oak doors here. And... Did, yeah, we. I think when it shows open, we've already done it. Yep. Heavy oak doors and heavy oak doors locked. Which way do we go? Oh, we have a... Uh, Nope, that's back to the surface then. Save the room. Yeah. Let's head that way. Whoops, that's not even... Oh yeah, there we go. Sure, let's head this way first since it's probably the way out. And then we'll head back the other way. Perception failed. Anyone else want to try? Perception failed. You got a good perception? Perception failed. Wow. There's probably a trap here. Uh, we failed our perception check, but uh, we percepted that there's a perception check to begin with. Very meta. Uh, let's go ahead. Split. Whoops, not group hide. Uh, split the group here. And you have temporary health. It's weird tanking with uh, with the warlock, but it might actually be the best bet. The button over there. Oh, come on. Okay. Uh, group, group back up. Everyone, get over here. Cool. Event trap. Uh. Jeez. Traps. Okay. There's a button here. What could go wrong, right? Are there traps everywhere? Whoa. Okay. Oh. Whoops. Cancel. I want... I guess we can go ahead and disarm him anyway, in case. Ooh, don't walk into it. Okay. As long as we don't roll a one. Oh! What did I just say? Uh, roll again. Use inspiration. Um... Jeez. Yeah, I think I will. We we only have four. It's a very finite resource, but so are trap disarm tools. I can't believe it. Um Yep. Okay, better. Jeez. Unbelievable. Uh so yeah, we should still have two. Yep. Let's go ahead and do the next one. 
All right, as long as we don't roll a one. Okay, good. Jeez. I don't know what the button did. Oh. Oh, uh, we got a uh, thing there. The hardest thing here is the perception and not rolling a one. And we're not even getting achievements for, or uh, XP for uh, that. Uh, let's see. Uh, tutorials, it was, does it highlight it? It should highlight the recent ones, but I don't think it does. Uh, something about traps. Combat class. Uh, where was it? Camp for rules. Hidden. Exploration. Prime gameplay. Inventory. I'm not seeing it, man. Can we? Oh, that's the date. Uh, it's annoying. But yeah, here's how you get the uh, inspiration, right? One, two, three. Oh yeah, four. So that's how we had it, but we used one. But yeah, uh, what was that? I don't know. I don't know what the tutorial said, but that's fine. Uh, keep disarming just so we're not running into them just keep not oh and that expired keep, just keep not rolling ones okay okay uh sarcophagus silver band skull and bones Moving. that was unbelievable there might be a trap there unbelievable oh Someone's left to track up. Who is that? No, I don't think so. Almost looks like you could get in there, but. Yep, not enough space. Uh, let's go over this. Traps. How considerate. We failed one. We got one. Just don't roll more ones, please. Hey. Critical success. Critical success. Uh... Oh, fine. Get your torch out. Let me check that. Again, I don't know if there's one there. Oh, maybe not. Maybe there aren't ones on the side. Yeah, I wish these gave XP. I'm just clearing them so I don't run into them accidentally, but it'd be nice if they gave XP. Whoops. Be careful. There are traps. Oh. I wonder how you even trigger them. I could have already disabled them. I don't know. Maybe the sarcophagus would trigger them. A trap. Someone doesn't like this. 30. Oh, that. Oh, dear. Someone's left to trap. I can't believe we rolled that one. We're statistically heading back towards it, too. Not today, Satan. Okay. I guess we have done those. You got more good stuff for me? Soul coin, war pick, ring mail armor. An iron coin. I prefer gold. A, ooh, a rapier. Another rapier. That's good. Unfortunately, 
doesn't do a whole lot. And yeah, we've already checked that one. There was only one sarcophagi over there. All right. Um, ooh, there's a skeleton. Almost missed that one. Dagger. I'd love to find a magic dagger for my, actually. Why am I? Why do I care? Just because he's my main character, I'm like, I want a magic dagger for the guy who never makes dagger attacks. I'm not sure I've ever made a dagger attack. It's all about that. Uh. Oh, there's one we missed. Okay, so that's all the traps did. Okay. Open up. Oh! Engraved key and watcher's guide, which is a versed, a spear. Okay, take all. Can we... Yeah. Can I disarm? Can't reach. Can't reach. That's annoying. Will the button turn it off? Yes, indeed. Okay. So I overdid it on the traps. All right, let's see what we got here. Yeah, I don't care about any of that. That's cool. We got another soul coin, I guess. Oh, I should check what it does. I just got so excited to see a magic item. I assume I can use it, can use it uh, well, but for all I know, it won't be better than what we currently have. Um, okay, 1d8 if used two-handed, 1d6 otherwise. Death's Promise. When the spear misses its target, the wielder's next atta attack roll against that target gains True Strike, which is what? Advantage. Gives Rush Attack. Time has dampened the spear's sheen, but the center glows a faint blue. The magic it exudes feels old, terrible, and divine. The spear was given to its previous owner for its unerring loyalty even after death. Um, okay, so who would do well with that? I, have a load on my mind. I am actually profi well. proficient, but it's a strength weapon, so that's no point. You're not going to do well. You're not... Oh, you are proficient, but again, strength weapon. Uh... Two, three, oh, okay. Tenacity versus Death's Promise. And you're probably, even even with Versatile, it's not going to be as good. Yeah, so basically if we want to equip it on someone, it's going to be um, Shadowheart. Uh, point, question is, do we would we rather have Concussive Smash? Uh, Daze is your target. I can't... Uh, Two through nine, so yeah, same damage. Two through five, target loses an action, or if we miss, we get to attack again. I think just for novelty, and I wanna, I wanna do that. We've got a magic item. Well, we've had magic items. We got a magic weapon. Oh, and. Can she do two-handed? Uh, I think I'd rather have the AC, considering she's going to get sometimes into melee combat. Well, yeah, that's fine. But yeah, out of curiosity, two through seven, two through nine. Yeah, we can two-hand it. Pretty cool. All right. Like I said, we got a magic item. And we got a key on someone. Uh, let's keep ancient door. I'm thinking you probably have the key for that. You don't. Oh yeah, and we have heavy armor too. That would only be you, but last time we found it, it wasn't as good. Uh, keychain, open. Engraved key. Examine? And I think it would be used automatically, so I guess we just lock pick. <laughs> Easy. 15. It is a it is a big one. Okay, we did it. Uh good, good, good. Um, what was I gonna do? Oh yeah, um whoops. Tab. Let's check. 14, 13. 
Oh, oh, I thought you were proficient. I guess it was, uh, Lizel. Okay, yeah, no, yeah, it must have been Lizel. Uh, you put your torch away. You put your torch away. Not as bad as it could have. Save. Ancient door open. Oh, oh, hey, hey, hey. Angled fish are empty. Okay. Cool. Uh, let's get back in there. Very cool. That's cool, though. We got a... Whoop. Oh, just grease. We fell down. Get up already. There we go. And... There we go. I was going to be... Whoops. Yeah, let's leave those open. I was like, I feel like we lost someone in the Nestarian. Ran up. Oh, there's a door here as well. I didn't even notice that. Yeah, that was the big door. There's a door there as well. Oh, is that where we came in? It must have closed afterward. No? Where did we come from? Yeah, because that we haven't explored. Did we come in with two ornate chests? I forget. But yeah, I think we've been here for just for some reason. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot that was a transfer. Okay, we're correct. Yeah, yeah, makes sense. Um, whoops, wrong way. Over here. Jeez, my computer feels like it's taking off. Alright, uh, oh, is this gonna be the key? Kina's taken engraved key from Asterian. Yep, alright. That's cool, she's got a spear now. I'm entombed scribe. Okay. Just want to check to see if there's anything back here. Nope. Armed scribes, but no sign of a struggle. Dagger and gold. I wonder what was so subversive about their words that they commanded protection. More junk. Yeah, let's light some stuff up. Another scroll, another quarter staff. A door. A heavy key. Just trying to get some more light in here. The candles don't do much on their own. Yeah, there's a door over there. Whoops. Uh -oh. That's Jurgle, scribe of the dead. I didn't think anyone still worshipped him. A scimitar. How close are we to encumbered to getting there? We'll do this thing before where we just throw it on everything, everyone else. The inscription is in a language unknown to you. Uh, Ever comes I'm assuming it's going to be the same for everyone. The inscription is in a language unknown to you. The inscription <laughs> yep. is in a language unknown to you. The inscription is yeah, in yeah, a yeah. language I get it. unknown to you. I get it. I'm sorry I tried to be clever. Ooh, interesting. 
quarter staff. There's a lot of different ways to go here. Okay, this doesn't go anywhere. Unless that's a door, but no one's detecting it. Oh, can we light that up there? Can't reach this. Okay, we've got somewhere over here. Oh, someone want to get that? Hey, I already saw that though. Good facial expressions. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Big uh oh, man. Big uh oh. Hells. Something just woke up down here. Let them come. That smells like a long rest to me. Hopefully, not the longest rest. The eternal rest. And yeah, we've got a room that actually hopefully has some treasure in there. Uh, let's see what we got. We got an entombed warrior over there. We have entombed scribe, entombed scribe, entombed scribe, entombed scribe. So let's try to stay where we are. Can we sneak attack? Are we sneaky? Okay. Um. Can we go like over here? Yes, here. Uh, can we sneak attack? Must have advantage against target. Okay, so let's hide. Um, why? Oh shit! Oh, I did hide instead of cunning hide. I should just remove that. Uh, quick save. Shoot, we'd have to go through all that again. That's kind of annoying. All right. Um, get out of here. Can we? Can we move you over here? We can. All right, cunning hide. Uh, same sort of thing then. <laughs> oh man, all right, we missed some damage. Um, we can't do anything else. I guess run back. If we really need to, we can save scum here because that didn't feel great. Um, and yeah, we've got both things on the table but we would have anyway we could dash but yeah it's not worth it without action points um Survival is all that matters. let's go ahead might be oh we could scorching ray someone again we could also witch bolt we've never witch bolted yet and it's kind of nice um, can we see what these guys are? Like, I, I haven't been paying a whole lot of attention to resistances, but vulnerable to bludgeoning, immune to poison. Oh, of course we swapped. We had a bludgeoning weapon, and then we swapped it to a spear, of course. Um, oh, and you still have a torch out. That's fine, I guess. Um, so, yeah. How much health do you have? 41. All right. We are gonna, whoops, we are gonna strength hit you. What? I don't want to melee. Why can't you smart These get in? Everything. There we go. 
And... Ooh. Not great attack. 55. Why is it so low? I think I'm just going to hit you with everything, though. You have... Ooh. Not even that great. And let's bring you back. And... Nope, not enough resources. I think that takes an action. Yep. Whoops, no. Uh, and turn. It's go time. Uh, you're gonna, you're gonna have to mail it or range tier two because there's no way you can get over there. Um. For the rest of your turn, roll range damage twice? I don't think so. I hope that can see. Jimmy on the go. Hey, it's better than nothing. Oh, you missed. Alright. Uh, bring, bring out your... Oh. Okay, good. Um, I guess that's going to have to do it. What... No. Uh, long rest. Um, yeah, we're just chilling. Maybe I should rage though. That'll, yeah, we'll rage next turn. Mm. I'd love to. Oh, actually, we've got turn undead. Pray to turn all undead that can see you. Can't take actions, bonus actions, or real actions other than dash or try to escape to effect an effect that prevents movement ends upon taking damage. Channel divinity, which is recharge on short rest. Uh, is that bonus action or not? It's not. It's a normal action. Our bonus action is shield of faith. We're going to rest, so we might as well use our bonus action. Yeah, let's bonus action shield of faith on Carla. Shield of faith is... Uh, increase its armor class by two. Bonus action. Noise. And question is, do we turn undead first or do we heal to make sure... You're healthy because you only have 14 health. Uh, I guess we save because we don't even have movement to get. Uh, I'm not sure if that would count as in vision. So, yeah, I think we'll move up. And, ooh, I don't want to get grouped too closely though. Um, oh, except I need to heal anyway. So, yeah, let's move up right next to. Actually, let's move up in front. And cast heal. Take two. Noise. That's what I like to see. Um. And and actually, I guess we could split up a little bit more in case they do have AOE. So yeah, let's uh, let's get up front there. Fog cloud blind. Fog cloud blind. Dash. I like the jingling they're doing. Ray of Frost. Ooh, which missed. All right. Uh, blind. Whilst on surface. Oh, cool. So it's actually something we're in. So. Oh, wait. Wait. Oh, you're not immune to blind. You have dark vision, but that's different. You're still blinded. Okay, can I get out? Damn, that's a lot. Oh, we can pull back, though. But I don't think I would have vision at that point. I wonder. I wish you could see. Is there a way to see? If we select you... Fog, 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 fog. 
Oh, fog. Yeah, we'd have to be like way back here and it still doesn't do it. Um, but we can't get there either. Um, oh, and Never a dull moment. Uh, who do I want to move first? Carlac. 30 disadvantage. Uh, we can jump behind you. You have 25 health now. That's fine. Uh, yeah, you're moving next. Yeah, let's let's go ahead. Oh, uh, we could rage. Yeah, jump would take that, but I think that's. I think we still want to use jump instead of rage because anything else is gonna. I think provoke attacks. Um, yeah, and I can't get out of the fog otherwise, so I think we will jump over this guy. Question is, do we want to jump over him? Oh, we can't get there. So yeah, let's jump behind this guy. Looks pretty good. Wait, what? Okay. Wait, is he blinded now? No, I guess we were unblinded. Um, reckless attack. I'd rather not take more damage. We can't cleave. We can't lacerate. Undead can't lacerate. So yeah, we basically just have main hand weapon. Ah, oh, low roll, man. Yeah, we rolled a four. Unfortunate. Let's turn someone inside out. Okay, and... Oh, you can bonus dash as one of your bonus actions. Yeah, let's, uh, let's... Dash? Yeah, that's good. Dash? Um, there we go. And will that be fine? Don't cool. And let's go ahead. Sneak attack melee. We have yeah. Fifty five. Nice. Twenty five gold. Um We've got a bonus action, which is just offhand. We can't get to anyone for that, which is unfortunate. We almost can. Let's move up. Again, I'm kind of trying to split up in case of AoE. That'll have to do. Can't even catch my breath. You're... Oh, you have Hex. Oh, we can recast Hex. Oh, are you guys channeling? You're yeah, you're concentrating. Okay, that's one thing to keep in mind is if we just hit these guys. Um which reminds me, can we Target is too far and you can't jump through there, huh? Okay, we can just make it. Question is, is it fog? I don't think so. So I think that's actually what we'll do right there. And why is it saying too far? Like we can actually whatever. Blinded, gone. Oh, we used our bonus action. Uh, oh, they don't have a whole lot of health. Uh, three through ten, four through thirteen. Concentration broken. Yeah, I should have thought of that. Um, let's keep chasing this guy down. You're in the fog. I think we'll do the same thing. Uh, we should, considering we have a weapon that can be thrown, maybe we should re-add throw to this, uh, common, uh, throw. We'll add that, like, down there. The damage of thrown weapons is the same as the weapon's melee damage. So, yeah, we can select the spear if we want, if we ever need a ranged attack. Um, as is, I think we will do the same thing and try to take this guy out. Oh, we don't even need to jump. But yeah, we can't make it without the jump. Because, yeah, we can jump 18 feet uh, for 10 feet of movement. We could also charge, but that doesn't do enough damage. Oh, you know what? We're going to want to range anyway. Or 1 through, t one through 10. Anyway, um... 
actually, what do we have as bonus actions? Nothing. So let's go ahead. Let's just go ahead and climb. We can. Oh, let's leave our. Let's see. We need 10 feet. So yeah, uh, we move 30. So we can move up here and then figure out from there. Um, so we can do two through nine at 75. Uh, we can throw. I just want to see how that works. Uh, yeah, 79 at range. 70 or not 79. It was 75. So yeah, two through nine versus one through 10. Uh, you weak to anything? Bludgeoning vulnerability. That's piercing. That's piercing. I guess we just do the ranged attack. Oh, we could. Oh yeah, we were talking about turn undead. Um, that's oh, and it's only thirty-five percent, uh, and we've only got one. So yeah, let's not. Let's just do two through nine. Hope to high roll here. Ah, uh, we rolled a three out of eight. Hi. Right. Swap you, and let's jump to try to lock this guy down. And you got nothing. Ow, three damage. Uh, yes, please. Haha. <laughs> fog cloud? Alright, these guys ain't so... T I shouldn't say that when they still have turns here. Nope, they're just fog clouding. They're just fog clouding. Um... Reduced movement, ray of frost. I think this is gonna. Oh, can we? We don't have advantage, so we can't sneak attack, right? Must have advantage. Uh, Carlac could go over there too, although she'll probably just kill him on her own. Um, <laughs> okay, where where are people? We've got one over there. Oh, okay. Okay. How much do you have? Thirteen. 13. Uh, let's go ahead and jump to this guy. Not enough movement. Nonsense. Surely you have enough movement. Thirty feet. Are you slowed or something? No, not really. You can move. I wish it said, where does it say how much? 30. I wish we'd put the gale. Oh, we can't. Oh, no, we could. We could cast on her before adding her to the party. Uh, so, yeah, shoot. We can only move 20 feet. Um, that's bullshit. Uh, so, yeah, let's move... 19.7 and then hopefully get a jump off. That'll have to do. And then that is 85 versus 98. Okay, so we could almost guarantee you have enough health. That's fine. Let's do that. Nice. Let's loot. Nothing. Okay, Astarian, can you take out this dude? Uh, not enough movement. Uh, we can use 10 movement to jump 15 feet. We have... Why? What is... Movement? Oh, that's right. You had the... Uh, Long strider, so you can move 30 feet. So we'll do the same thing. We will move like 19 feet, jump. Oh shoot, you don't have. Ah uh, shoot. Uh, then let's. I guess we'll be doing. That's too bad that we couldn't angle it right. Um, I guess we'll jump here so we at least don't have low ground, and we will take a. Oops, that's not what I meant. We will take a ranged attack. If we crit, we could hit. Um, oh, are you are you looking this way? Well, you're not. We can sneak. 
Let's have a little fun. Nice. And then, whoops, that just gets too confusing. And then, sneak. And you know what? We can get rid of this bar entirely. We can, like, move things over here. There's no rule saying we have to do that differently. Um, not sure if we can get rid of that or not. But anyway, uh, I'll just leave that around there. Uh, melee. That's actually a pretty good setup. Skip a little bit there. And then, oh, and this should go up in melee. Um, but yeah, let's do a ranged sneak attack with advantage. Uh, Oh, 26. That's rude. And uh, can we get there? We can, 27 gold. That was, I think, our biggest damage yet. Um, You got nothing, right? Yeah. Another fight. Let's go. And Karlak, you had nothing as well, yeah. Blood comes easy these days. Okay. Um, Can't afford to let up. Shadow Heart, you're closer. Can you? Uh, let's. Oh shoot, I forgot. Range is actually better for her, but as long as you can hit, yeah. Con oh, you, you, you bastard! You concentrated. You utter bastard. Um, you have a bonus action. Can't really do anything with it though. And turn. Well, That's too peace. bad. Um, guess we can just drop back. I don't know if that's going to be too close to suffer penalty. Um, I wish it would tell you. Because, yeah, right now you are blind. We can get out of the fog here. There we go. Blinded is gone. Uh, 85. Perfect. Uh, let's recast. Doesn't really matter. We'll do strength. Oh, shit! What? You can't cast from there. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Whatever. There we go! Fools. Rising from the dead just to protect some dusty old baubles. I'll loot with her since my other character is getting overloaded. That was a fun fight. And... We didn't end up taking a whole lot of damage, but uh, we probably will rest at some point anyway since we're out of spells. Um, but yeah, that was a fun fight. Did we get this guy? I think so. We were just up there, yeah. Empty, empty, empty. Just empty. Oh, we'll light a candle for the dead. Oh, didn't I light that one? thought I did. Button, we already opened it. Let's see what we got. A lot of effort to hide one sarcophagus. Uh, explore the ruins. We found a large sarcophagus. Who lies within? Ooh. Speak with the dead. Potion of mind reading. Okay. Uh, I'm thinking... The potion of dead, the potion, of, sorry, not potion, uh, the uh, amulet of speak to the dead is immediately going to be useful. We are in a room with a sarcophagus now, ain't we? Let's go back to our main character. Here lies the guardian of tombs. Through knowledge comes atonement. And... Uh, put that on me. Sure, I'm not even sure if it can be used in combat. It's a ritual. Doesn't work on, oh, it doesn't work on undead. Grant a semblance of life to a humanoid corpse. It is ritual, that's nice. Allowing it to answer up to five questions. Skeletons and creatures killed with acid fire, lightning, necrotic, or radiant damage no longer have a mouth and can't be made to talk using the spells. Alright, let's go ahead and save here. Richly adorned sarcophagus.
<laughs> oh boy. And here I thought it would actually be a dead guy that we could use the amulet on. This is a undead person. So he has spoken, and so thou standest before me. Right, as always. What a curious way to awaken. Now, I have a question for thee. What is the worth of a single mortal's life? Attack. A peaceful and dead. Interesting. Why aren't you attacking me? A little spooked by crawling out of the tomb bit. What are you? Quite the question. What's the reason for it? Curiosity. Nothing more. Wilt thou answer my question? Yes, ask away. So, I ask again. What is the worth of a single mortal life? <laughs> uh, depends on the person's deeds, perhaps. Depends on the mortal. I am sure thou believest as such. Very well. I am satisfied. We have met, and I know thy face. We will see each other again at the proper time and place. Farewell. Hmm. That's interesting. Uh, strange figure emerged from the, one of the sarcophagi we opened. Seems like he has something to say. The strange figure said he would see us again soon. He was probably the ruin's greatest secret, but there's no harm in checking for more valuables. Whee! Dang, elixirs. Here I saw the magic and was like, oh, let's go. Okay, is that everything is the question. He checked all those. Don't waste a step. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, it's not everything because uh, there's still a door on this side, I think. Yep. Another jug for me. Book of knowledge. Without doubt. What is that? And you're still almost over encumbered. Whatever, we'll figure that out. Silver necklace. Dang, just just value. I thought it was a. Uh... Ooh, another studded shield. Uh, and not that it's special. I just like the look of it better. So uh, we will go ahead and put that on her. Looks good with the spear too. Okay, book of dead gods. Which is locked. I wonder what the point of that is. I wonder what the point of this is. Uh, illuminate. I haven't used this, but that's actually... That's actually could be quite useful. I'm just trying to figure out, is there... Death? Yeah, let's not. Uh, 
That's pretty cool. But yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything down there. That's interesting. Book of Dead Gods. Let's see what we got here. This book is far lighter than it should be with such a massive oh, lock. Oh, that's why it's locked. Don't we have the, the key? Warlock and Charisma, so we've got plus three, plus three from Arcana too. Let's do the one that's our class, just because that's kind of cool. We'll channel our patron's strength into the lock. Noise. You get to be all warlocky. As the lock opens, a loose page comes with it. Magic pulses from the parchment. What was once script is now an obliterated scroll. You have a sense these are names, a list. But of what? Religion, examine the book closely. Come on. Ten, okay. Cool. Gods. These Shadow are Hearts the names proof. of gods. Once lost, but now restored after the second sundering. The last three names in this book sit close together, but are so devastated by the scroll as to be unreadable. Entire pantheons have dwindled and been reborn, silently recorded by this book. Sage, Secrets of the Sundering. And we already checked that, yeah. Acolyte, Divinity, and then Shadowheart is inspired too. Alright. Oh, let's take it. I am received scroll ray of enfeeblement, but why? And whoops. Names of dead gods must have been unfamiliar. Fill the pages of this ancient tome. Several entries on the last page have been stricken through. Uh Cool, cool, cool. Uh, let's just check. No, that's not it. Uh, JL. No. Journal. Uh, inspiration. So we got. Unlock and read the Book of the Dead Gods. Unlock and read the Book of the Dead Gods. That yeah, was fun. I, I'm really enjoying the pacing of this game. Uh,. So yeah, I think I've got everything now here, right? We came in here. We're going out here, potentially. Is that a door? Let's go back just to check. I don't think so. Nope. All right, cool. And yeah, the game does feel smoother tonight, so hopefully that shows up on stream too. I did, like I said, I do have it in uh, full screen now instead of semi full screen. Fake full screen. And did we, yeah, we, I was, I was going to say, did we uh, dig the last uh, dirt pile? But we did. Okay, we've got a ladder here. I wonder if this is going to be the hatch. And is there anywhere else to go? No. Okay, well that was a fun little romp. And yeah, I'm glad I remembered about my lights. That can be that can be pretty useful for exploring darker places. And it is a ritual. Or no, it's just it's a it's oh it's a cantrip. We'll have to look for uses of talk to dead too. Yep, that's what I thought. The hatch there, cool. And yeah, we did do, dig the second one there. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, I think the only last thing to check is... Whoops, let's, uh, let's actually stay away from those vines. It'll be easier to walk around this way. That was weird. Oh, there's some 
should we go talk to dead fishermen? See what they have to say? Wish we had feather fall. Huh, I don't remember twisting vines in there, and this is not being lit up. Let's see, can you jump down there? You would take three damage? I mean, we're gonna rest anyway. I guess we could jump down and take one damage. Oh, actually, we don't even need to. There we go. Uh, oh, this is a completely different area. We've been here, though, right? Yeah. Oh, there's a mirror. Let's have a look at myself. Nope, it's not. Can't be added to inventory. Can we move it though? Why is it? Dang, and I felt so clever, but there's nothing there. Can what about the mirror? Can we move the mirror? We can. Maybe. Yeah, so I was wrong about where it ended up, but it did throw us back in here, and that's the door we already opened. Right, what's that? Door, no handle, yep. Okay, uh, let's get out of here. How close are we to the entrance? Is that a door? No, that's just wall. Okay, yeah, we're good, we're good, we're good. Let's get out of here. They picked a fight with the wrong people, huh? We we solved the one out here peacefully, and then they were just like, no, we're going to attack the hell out of you, and then I murdered them all. It was pretty great. Did we check this plaque? I think so. Oh, yeah, is it indecipherable or Time something? And the elements unreadable, the yep. Unreadable. Alas... I want to try out the uh, speak to undead or whatever. I am going to go uh, to those fishermen. There's goblins here, but who wants to talk to... Actually, there's a goblin village. I wonder if the dead goblins will tell us anything. So, yeah, there is a qu there are some quests involving goblins, so let's uh, speak with dead. Damn, look at us. Okay, so it is, I guess, special... Oh shit, I wait, it's ritual. We're out of co co it's ritual but only works once. Shit. I I see. Okay. Question is it drained itself? What if we I mean I, I don't think this will work, but yeah. But if we give it to someone else? Carlac. Yep, that's what I thought. Worth a try. All right, that's unfortunate. It it shouldn't spend it if it if it's not gonna work. Um, okay. Do we long rest here? We don't have warlock spells. We don't have cleric spells. Uh, she's used some stuff too. Yeah, we don't have smite. We still have other things, but it might be best to just rest here. We could also try to take one more fight because uh, everyone's at full health. Um, yeah, we got rid of some of that stuff, so hopefully we don't get screwed up again. Um, Never a dull moment. Anything I want to get through? Book of Dead Gods. Cool. Oh, uh, did did we get any quests? No, it was. Oh yeah, it was the uh, inspiration. I thought we got quest on Shadowheart, but nope. Just the inspiration. All right. What the heck is next? Uh, I guess we can clear chapel. We did that. Uh, we can clear hatch. We did that. We can steal a sacred idol. Uh, I guess our next goals, which will not be tonight. I've streamed for uh, quite a while here. 
Uh, I guess our next goals will be we'll clear out the uh, fake paladins. Make Karlak happy. And then I want to solve this druid uh, issue. So we'll we'll try to make our way down there. That'll probably be crossing the bridge. We also have Druid Halson. He might be able to help us with that too, but I am curious about the investigation. Oh yeah, and that's the uh, door no handle, which we cleared. So let's, uh, oh, I can't. Do we have to go back down there if we want to clear that? That's annoying. Um, I'll just leave it for now, but yeah, it puts them in weird places. Like that's perception check and perception check, which are somewhere in the, uh, there. Oh yeah. We have to uh, save the goblin at the same door. Um, yeah. We turned to Zebler. That's fake. Oh, uh, no, I'll leave that there. That's useful to remember where she was. Uh, cave Albert. Uh, crevice too big. Albear cave. Bridge slash under. We did the under. Yeah, so I think that's going to be our plan. We're going to venture out into this area. We're going to venture out into this area. Uh, do, 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 do. Jumpity jump. I don't think that actually does anything. Waterfall area. We pretty much did that. Door not interactable. That is for the I'll leave that there too even though we did that vault inside I want I want I want to find the vault save the refugees all right yeah maybe we'll do the cave too I I, I was saving it because I was wondering if we'd get any quests from the Emerald Grove for that so yeah we'll actually hit that up on our way too we'll do Albert cave hunt the devil and investigate Kaga or something of course of course, this being a little bit open world, uh, we're always open. We're, we're always the option is there to find other things and get sidetracked. But that's the general game plan: is cave, hunt the devil, anything else in this area. I mean, we saw a town, so I'm thinking, I'm thinking we will probably get a little sidetracked in this area. But we'll see. But yeah, Albert Cave, uh, hunt the devil, uh, Kaga. Maybe over there too, Auntie Etzel. And then I guess, and then I guess this is the, this seems like one of the big ones too is uh, Halson and oh yeah, at some point we should free her as well because she said she can introduce us or some shit like that. She's a goblin. We'll goblinize, and so yeah, that's that's uh, that gets that covers some of our big quests: save the refugees, save goblin. Uh, steal a sacred idol, which again, I'm hoping we don't have to do because uh, I'm hoping to resolve things friendly like with the uh, with the druids instead of being uh, a jerk. All right, that should pretty much do it for the night. Let's go ahead and save here. 14 hours. Whoa, don't get on fire there. That was pretty funny. Carlax, cool. All right. Um, oh yeah, I wanted to briefly talk about uh, the patch notes. Uh, I won't go into huge detail or anything. I just let's see if there's anything that jumps out at me. Oh yeah, I said level up will now queue all characters who can level up, so you don't have to click on them individually. Fix some cor corpses never showing empty tag after you loot them. That's nice. I was complaining about that. And I don't know what it is yet, but there's a feat called Spell Sniper, and it doesn't work on attack spells. Uh, and it, so yeah, they fixed it, and now it does, and it will now correctly reduce critical hit threshold by one. So if that seems uh, like a good choice, that's that's better now, and uh, we'll work with our... So yeah, we could make our uh, our spells more likely to crit or something. Misty Escape, which we looked at, that's the teleport spell. That will no longer break concentration, so you can now teleport while concentrating. Kind of cool. Reading shop signs will no longer be considered a crime. I like that one because I, I, I mean, it, there's some weird stuff that suddenly just like, yeah, that's a crime. You're a criminal. Uh, this one's just funny. Uh, fixed, fixed, fixed 
spells being interrupted by climbing, allowing you to attack twice after climbing down from a crate. I wonder if anyone was actually abusing that or it was just a bug they noticed. Like, imagine that. You're like, you're like placing crates, climbing up, climbing down, attacking like mad. Uh, I just like that. Um... And yeah, this is cool. Fix some small holes in Act 1 that weren't letting tiny characters through them. So yeah, that is that is a thing. It's what I suspected. Like if you're if you're a small character, you get some options to go through some things. Uh, added a dialogue option to the first in-person dialogue with the dream visitor to avoid only having two antagonistic choices. That's nice. Like more choices are good. I'm not sure why why you could only be antagonistic there. We don't we haven't gotten there yet. Um, rewrote some spell and action descriptions that were too vague. Excellent. Uh, and this one's just kind of funny. Fix Shadowheart looking like she's either in pain or about to sneeze in the background of a dialogue with some character, and added some missing boo squeaks. That one is of course game changing and uh high level alrighty that should do it uh, I think that about covers it yeah I think things went a little smoother stream wise today hopefully it did seem like it did seem like we had less drops uh there's some settings I can change to if I need to I wish my uh I'm gonna have to get a different hardware monitor um, because again, Riva Tuner was conflicting with with everything. Uh, maybe I can turn it off on games and then still have it display on a second monitor, but I don't want it trying to capture the games. So yeah, maybe that's what I'll do. And the only reason I'm mentioning that is I want to, you know, get a feel for how much uh, GPU versus CPU we're using, where the, where any issues are coming from, temperature stuff like that and the monitor I was using uh, it was not letting me capture at the same time as OBS and was causing crashes and stuff um, let me get out of the game here anyway I just wanted to make a little announcement there about what was going on uh, so yeah that'll do it thanks for watching guys uh, peace I'll be back tomorrow probably with something catch you later